I am standing here at the Cassesua Agroforestry. And this is a place that uh, it's, it's, uh, it's an idea that started off by my cousin, Eunice Kamara. And I want to introduce you a little bit to one of the projects in Cassesua Agroforestry, and which is fishing. I love fishing. And as a young boy, I always loved going fishing by the river. I'm literally standing next to the little Skiasis River. And my cousins here have started a little bit of fish farming. And the person who's been leading this particular project is yes, it's up for you. The person who's been leading this whole project, Nami one or cousin, L M K. L M K nine lead this one whole project as for do this fish farming. So first of all, what now the first thing we you do? All right, thank you, Mr. Yusuf. Um, let me say where you want to start this fish farm. At least you get for. Select a site where you know say where somebody affect the forest for the around it because at least the fish the fish pond if for the in cool weather the water not for warm too much where the water warm too much the fish then will die understand so we therefore look the site where they select where a forest area where will be shade to all that that's not the number one then from there we get step two step two. You get for dig a hole, a, a four-sided figure hole. Um, you get for um, this is what we call tapoli. Um, you get for what you make the measurement of the tapoli and to the um, way figure I dig the hole. You get what the measurement of the tapoli for before you dig the hole. So when you don't dig the hole, um, at least if you want the cable designer, but we can just left step now because some fish think they like you don't just kind of one kind of deep side mm -hmm. or else like you want to come back for kawa kawa ka so certain area because when they did like one 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 kind of like corner and you know let me go left to step here mm -hmm. right so after you don't dig the hole down don't pick out the um tapoli then you you fix the tapoli the tapoli get hold stand not stand inside the block block camp you go and block her. You may have fine. You go and block block her. All the four, the four corners. Mm -hmm. So when you don't block and don't, you know, say the tapoli don't step fine, don't hold fine. What see they do next? Or pump water, try to bring water inside the fish pond. And I think to say one of the good things is that yeah. we're literally next to the uh, main river now, yeah. so the little scarces. Yeah. So we're able to pump water. Yeah, we're able to pump water for cut inside, for cut inside the, the fish pond. Yes. Right, of course. Um, where you done with pumping the water, you get for take small few dirty and put her inside because because of waiting, the fish take leg like for um get some side side they hide themselves. Mm -hmm. Um, you know. So you put dirty like this dust, one. Yes, put yes. small dirty no more yes. like that because the leg like, at least at times when they do they feed when they feed themselves, mm -hmm. like normally feed with small dirty because uh -huh. that small dirty they go able. Get small half half and so we go able make them digest the food there. The food, yes, I see. So that make we need for let them get small dots on the leg for hide hide some side there. Yeah. Right. So after we done, we don't you don't pump the water, you don't put it dots down. Mm -hmm. Um you can take your food now, like um this that we normally yeah, because food, we'll, the, yes. I, that, I mean that's the next thing I wanted to ask yeah. about um about feeding. You know, how do you feed them yes so this now we use for feed them huh? this, this is um uh, by the way this is a termite, termite. mound yeah. a termite mound this one so yes yeah so i can just like this way Ooh, so this, there's this plenty is termite. of termites yes yeah plenty yeah, of them. yeah 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 let me let me see here so there's plenty of termites there yeah. so right by right. the time you throw this termite inside yeah you go, by the time you go no you see the fish in the jump jump Yes. In the jump jump. Okay, it's okay, it's a mind. <laughs> yes. And then you do the jump jump the camera. All right. So from that, so you can do that day every every um two times per day at least. Yes, twice a day. Okay. Twice a day. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you able to do that. So from there now, if the you, you, you're just wasting all the you're just wasting oh. all the food, all the food for the fish. Yes, ah, what's yes, your problem yes, now? Yes. <laughs> 
promise. <laughs> okay, no problem, no problem. But also, now yeah. we have to think now about when you fill up all of this, you don't yeah. put water inside as a better, better one. Yeah. Wait now the next thing now we get for do because now so nobody water just the left dirty dirty one throughout. No, not to say water the left dirty dirty one throughout. You because never the change the water? Yeah, I can change the water. How you change the water? Show it. Well, Show let me back. say okay, how I change on. the water. Yes. Because I get the okay. first I the first dig a uh, 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 gutter. Yes. Yeah, I get slight gutter where I don't dig. Mm -hmm. Um so that gutter day, yes. I fix me pipe today. Yes. After what I don't fix me pipe today. Yes. From then on this I know for broken yeah, you know totally broke because yes. mm -hmm. the water in wet go broken. Yes. Go inside. Yes. So I go just make a slightly I yes. put some slightly inside here. Yes. Don't I fix me pipe today. Yes. Um where I don't fix me pipe today, then I take the, the pipe with the tapoli, I find small rubber and tie tie, I tie them up together. So the water not able to escape from between this tapolia yes. or let it come on a door. Yes. So now here now I put tent now. What you make I put this tent here now? Mm -hmm. Fish not going to come through for kind side. Yes. Now all the water that will come through for kind side okay. for okay. exit come on a door. Yes. So now so I use me for empty the water inside the fish pond because if the right. water don't dirty, it don't dirty. Yes. So I can just empty now and put other one. And put around. So now so I can do things. Fantastic. Yes. And now, now, definitely inside where we're standing right now here, there is a lot of fish inside here right now. Now, if I, if I put my hand even slightly here, there will be fish. Now already there's fish jumping everywhere. Even, even when I step my feet, there will be fish jumping. Be fish. I just touch, touch one. <laughs> hey, I just hey, touch hey. another one. Now, oops, oops. <laughs> so basically, there's one. Oops, there's a. Oop, they're gone. But there is a lot of fish that are in here. Wow, this is gone already. Oh, it's gone. There's another one here. But there's a lot of fish that is in here already. Now, I think that this is a great oh, idea yeah. for sustainability. I think that we can do this in a very simple way. It's very, very cheap to be done um, and can be done effectively anywhere, I think. Um, but we got to follow the simple principles. Mostly in here, it's catfish. That is what's mostly inside here. And a few um, tilapia type of fish could also be put here, but mostly it is catfish that is in here. And I think we can do this sustainably and we can do this to create a massive economy in the uh, in the provinces in the provincial areas we can do this all right that's my view and i thank my cousin very well here yes been in addition to that <clears throat> because as soon as i see this uh, net yes so because we find out say animal and the way they come for can eat the fish <laughs> so now they could pass this net <laughs> around so that any animal who come for can eat the fish mm -hmm. will catch them i see so, oh, catch them. And I think one good thing is that because you get this covering, it means say birds, both they know they come inside for can take fish for care good just like that. Yeah, we respect the body they come inside, but we just think how for fair idea and fair idea we will do something. Okay, we okay. will save up. Okay, so tell other other next like this one can come on top yes, as well. Yes, no, so. yes, that means the color in mind. Right. 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 right, right. You see, and the good thing is that when you start this process, new ideas begin to come, new thoughts, new ways, new ways of how to do it better begins to come into place. But all it takes is for us as Sierra Leoneans to just start this process, start it, and the rest, as they say, is history. And true independence is about us feeding ourselves, taking care of ourselves. So those of you in the diaspora who would like to invest in areas like this, we have them in abundance. We have young men like this, young women around who could be invested in to take care of things like this. The land is here, the water is here. I want to encourage many of you to begin to think to invest in this. It does not take more than £1,000 or $1,000 to invest in quite a number of this. And we have people like my cousin here who are willing to do work like this and, um, and give it a few months and then you'll see what, what will get. And over time, and once you get the fish for the first time, you don't need to buy fish again. No In more. fact, you never buy fish, it is all free. We can get more of this, we can build more of this, we can, it can multiply and multiply and multiply. 
And um, that's all from the Cow Food Prince for today. My brother, thank yes, you very much. Yeah, thank you too. <laughs> God bless you. All right, cool.